Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Nate here with Nate's Tech Update. And Apple has just opened up this webpage here to developers that will allow me to transition my MobileMe account over to iCloud. So this will give you an idea for all of you guys that have MobileMe accounts out there, what you'll see this fall. So the actual URL of this webpage is me.com slash move. So let's go ahead and get started. So we'll be able to take um, the mail and the contacts and all the calendars that we build up currently with my Mia account over to iCloud without any uh, data being affected. Also, we'll, um, all of you with MobileMe accounts will be able to keep using Gallery, iDisk, as well as iWeb Publishing until June 30th, 2012, even after we make this transition. Some features will not be available uh, from the transition of MobileMe and iCloud, so Apple is doing away with the Mac dashboard wi widgets, the dock items, the keychains, the mail accounts, rules, signatures, smart mailboxes, as well as preferences. These weren't big issues for me, but uh, if you want to hold on to these items, you might want to wait uh, to transition over I to iCloud until June 30th, 2012, because at that point all MobileMe accounts will expire. Take a look at the requirements here. So you're going to need your device running iOS 5 beta 5 um, to update all your devices for iCloud at this point. And I do have 10.7.2 and iCloud beta 6 currently running on my computer. So let's go ahead and check this box here and click next. And let's move to iCloud. So I guess it says down here at the bottom this will take about five minutes, but we'll see how long this takes, and I'll let you know. Okay, so the transition has just finished up here, and it did take about five minutes, as the estimate had stated. Uh, you'll notice here that it's telling me to look for these alerts, both which have appeared basically instantly after arriving at this screen. You'll notice the screenshot here that I posted on the left-hand side of my iPhone 4. So let's go ahead and finish setting this up, and it looks like congratulations. I can now use my email to sign into iCloud. So thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I really appreciate it. Please like it, subscribe, and as always, have a nice day.